All right. I've got a little bit of issue here with traffic. Can you pause the music, please, Jeffrey? I don't know why it's carrying on. What are you doing? Are you all right? Texting your mum. Right, okay. Fair enough. Everything all right? She doesn't know how to... She <laughs> Wait, what? wants to know how to set up TikTok. Oh, Jesus. All right, have fun with that. Um, all right. Yeah, see, we've got a bit of an issue here with slow-moving traffic. Which is not ideal. So we may have to change this road type. Because it's too slow. It is far too slow. You know what I mean? It's like, this is it in real time. This is it in other time. Real time, other time, real time, other time. Why are you here? Have you been there the entire time? How did you get there? There's just an absolute... There's just a wad of people here for some reason. I can't get them out of there, though. They are now stuck there. Unless I was to change the road. So what I'm probably going to do... Hopping? What do you mean, hopping? Oh, yeah! What the hell's going on there? <laughs> okay. That's probably something to do with road anarchy, I'm assuming. Guys, all right? Is there an invisible bump there? Oh, there's a few visible freaking bumps there. All right, hang on. We should probably change this road up. Should we make it a... Uh, six lane? Maybe we should upgrade it. Oh, interesting. I don't think that's going to really help, but... um. Adding a whole nother lane in here. That may or may not help traffic a little bit. There's still a bump there. I don't know what's going on. It's something to do with... It's going to be something to do... Oh, hang on. Yeah, it's going to be something to do with this. Oh, shit. Oh, well, that helped the people. <laughs> yeah, there's going to... It's something under... I don't know what it is, but there's something underneath... I'm assuming there's a bump that we can't see. Oh, shit. I mean, I'm not really asked. Um, yeah, there, there appears to be some sort of a bump there that we, we cannot see. I don't know why <laughs> or what's actually causing it. Or well, why this bit here in particular is very, very slow. To be honest with you, this doesn't help. <clears throat> this really doesn't help. I feel like we need a different bit of road that leads... ...that comes off of here. It, 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 so, yeah, so... This is the issue, right? This, this is the City Skylines problem. Cars and their lanes... Or, or the way in which cars use lanes is really bad. It's always been that way. It's practically impossible to fix, except from when you have this rather lovely mod here. And what this does is it tells um, traffic where to go. And where it should be going. So, for example, the guys that are here... Now, I can't really do it here, unfortunately. I can't do it here. So at the moment, everybody who wants to go onto the roundabout is just sitting in this lane. Probably because they're all wanting to come off here. Or at least the majority of them are. However, that's really not what we want. I don't really want to do this too much. Because, um... Yeah, it's a, it's like it's a rabbit hole in, 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 its own, in its own right. Um, but we can try and force them to use certain lanes to go in certain places. Which, to be honest with you, sometimes is the only real way of of solving these issues. Like I said, though, it's it's not really something I want to be knobbing around with because it's 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 just an ass. It's a complete pain in the ass to do. But yeah, like I said, the main issue is really that um, the cars just don't use the lanes properly. I really want to know why that is bumping around like that so much. Pretty strange. But yeah, this is a pretty major issue we've got here in terms of traffic. So. The majority of people are going this way. Are they getting stuck anywhere else? There's a bit of a... a bit of a bit getting stuck here. Hmm. 
This probably could do with a roundabout. Um, to stop the traffic lights being on here. We can just quickly add one. Problem is, this bit here doesn't really help. I'm going to stop parking on here, to be honest with you, because parking on this is a really bad idea. Unfortunately, we did delete people's houses, but, you know, oh well. And that hasn't really helped either. I don't think it's made it worse. I guess as well, one of the other main issues is the fact that this is literally one of the main routes in and out of this area here. Of this, uh... Hmm, uh... Industrial bit. I feel like we need an alternative way that these people can... Because this bit here probably doesn't help very much. It causes a little bit of an extra traffic. This bit here... This is so freaking annoying. I, I, abs I can't... Discord is just the worst program in the world. Streamer mode is on, right? And yet it's like, Hi! Have a look at every goddamn notification. See, look. Disable notifications. It's actually on. But feck all happens. It's so useless. I don't need screen pop-ups. Which, which one is it? Avoid sending no push notifications to your mobile. No, that's not me that. Is it that? Desktop notifications? Because I don't need them. I don't care. Freaking useless ass program. Yeah, what we need to do is figure out a better method that we can get people here. Um, because <clears throat> as well, I think we're going to eventually, like I said before, we need to make this highway going over all of this. It needs to go over it. And we can then potentially have alternate roads that, that get in, but the, the main highway needs to be going over this. We need to have a number of routes to get on it. Except, you know, I'd rather people be going on and off the highways here and using the roundabout to get on and off highways. Um, the way it is. No, I think it pops up all the time anyway. No one's really using this car park. That's a complete waste. How are we doing? Actually, yeah, how are we doing trash wise? Uh, I can't remember where trash is. Oh, it is here. Uh, all right, we're only just process. We're only just doing it enough. Get another one down. Yeah, I don't know why they're doing this. I can't seem to figure that one out. There's going to be a bump or something weird underneath the road, which is causing it. Um, yeah, I don't know. This will only be there as well. How are we doing down here? How's traffic down here? So traffic here is actually okay. Not too bad. I do like the, the, the lit up front though. The lit up front looks well cool. I'm happy with that. Alright, okay. So, people want more... People want more... Like, office space. Let's add a couple of bit more of that. So, we want to try and find... I mean, we could use this. This over here, I feel like, could be Lake Flaccid. We're going to have, all the way around this, is going to be like a, uh, what is it called again? Like a nature reserve. Like the whole thing. But the main issue we have here is, from what I can tell, it's it's get, it's, it's this bit. It's going into, into here. Now we could, potentially, axe this and have this only as a way onto the roundabout. Like, change this bit entirely. So people have to go up here and make their way in. Use the bigger roads. Let's try that. Let's try that. This is only a way onto the roundabout. What the hell do you mean? Oh. That way, people are forced to go forward and around it. That might help. Where the hell are they all going? Are they just disappearing or is it just me? Oh, they are. 
Maybe they're timing out of their route, I think. I assume they're timing out of their route that they were already on. I, I assume. So now, these people will go all the way up here and make their way in via other routes. Or they'll do this and get on the freaking thing and then do it over here instead. Which is equally irritating. <clears throat> I don't think we should have these joints across here. I don't think these should exist. People have to go up and around, which is I'm okay with. I don't care about that. It is really satisfying watching all these go around. But then we have this issue here that we don't want. But that's because I haven't allocated a way of people getting from here over to here yet. Which is also a problem. Or even from here onto this little route here. I don't know yet. Which I guess I should probably try and address. Then I get rid of that. Mount Hardmore and Lake Flaccid. <laughs> uh. So should I have something coming off of this that leads around, or something coming off just before it that leads up and over, essentially? Now, was that high enough? That should be high enough, right? I go there. No, we're going to there. Okay, will you allow me to continue forward? Okay, so you will. So in theory, you should allow me to go over here as well. Place already occupied. I mean, obviously I could just, um... What do we call it? question is though, is this actually any quicker for them? That's the real question here. Is it actually any faster for them to go to take this route? Probably not. <laughs> However, it'll stop them doing that. Okay, it does work. But I feel like it's going to be absolutely cram. They get on that way. But essentially, they, right, they can come off of there now. So what's this route? We basically then need to do something similar from here, getting off down here. Otherwise, they have to go all the way up there. Which is then causing problems here with the, both the incoming traffic and everything else. Which is just chock-a-block at the moment. As you can see. It's absolutely mental right now. So, what if we do something similar? Now, can we, like, sweep this the other way? Put it right next to it. Sort of down into it here, and then joining on there, and then oh, it's a bit. I don't mean like it's a bit too close. What in the nine? That is not what I want to do. It's going to be weird, so we can just move that out. And that one goes all the way over there. So that's not too bad. And then that means I can delete that. So hopefully, people will not use this bit. And it could be worse. It's actually not a terrible looking road. <laughs> I think it actually looks quite cool, personally.
this bit here is a little bit wacky, but you know. I don't really know what I can do about this bit. Yeah, this bit here is just kind of a little bit mental, but that's fine. We can actually re-edit that one later. So that is basically now having people that are coming out here that can get off of here and go this way. People that are going this way can now jump off and go this way. So we've pretty much changed all of that. So what we're eventually going to want to do here is have the highway going over all of this and joining up with the height of here. And then we can have the additional roads running underneath it as alternative ways in and out. Because at the moment, everyone's coming in, hitting this roundabout, and then getting stuck. Which obviously is pretty useless. Eventually what we want to do is have this bit higher up, and then bits that come off of it, and then join the roundabout that way. So that they can just go straight over it. Because I imagine a bunch of this lot want to go straight over and down over towards this way. Ooh, hello! What have we got going on here then? That is quite the jam that's happening over here right now. There's a lot of people coming into District 69. I mean, obviously. Why wouldn't you go to District 69? Um. Okay. Oh my god! Jesus freaking Christ! Piss off! Where's the game over? Game overlay! Turd off! You mother frick. Maybe I press shift plus at some point. God damn. Yeah, that's quite a that's quite a jam going on here. What's going to be the best way to fix this? All of these guys are going across here to get back on. We have a bunch of people that are going straight across, across here, and then back up here just to go back on the uh, back on the main highway. So, in theory, one would say we should have a route that goes to that. But I just don't want to have too many roads that are leading all up. It's just like too many random spaghetti roads that are coming off, even though I need them, right? Okay. Like, these bits are fine. Once they get past this, it's everyone coming here who wants to go right here that is causing the jam. So, we need something that bypasses that. Or a better way of people getting in to that. Hmm. There's many people using the same freaking lanes. Look at this madness! Isn't that like freaking Mumbai or something where it's just crazy? Oh, the happy hamster. Yeah, where is the happy hamster? One of them was... I don't know which one it was. Best Sweat Gym. One of these was like some hamster place. I can't remember which one it was though. Oh my word. Yeah, we're getting quite the backup here. And all of these people... Well, not all of them. The vast majority of them. I wanted to go down here. Because ultimately, this is really the main route in, I suppose. This is literally our only route. Except from over here. Which people don't seem to be bothering with. Yeah, we, we, need, we need an alternative way. Or a better way. Of people getting through here. So, what would help this? Don't really want to do another roundabout, because that's just a pain in the ass. We just need a, a, a better method, or basically. That's all we really need, just a better method. So, I could do a bypass, but it's still ultimately not going to save any time. It's going to go from there to here, like, which is not ideal. The majority of people are going this way. Is there any way I can like help with the help with the traffic here? I don't really care where you go. That lane can go into any of those. I 
I actually don't know right now. So yeah, I, w I was thinking of, of doing a flyover that just kind of joins on down here, but that's just going to add even more problems. That it just it's, it's kind of like... It's not really fixing the issue, I don't think. And I also don't really know how many people are actually going to use it. Because we've got people here that want to leave. And we've got people here that want to come in. The only real place I could have the flyover, which I don't even know if it's gonna, if it's even gonna be viable, is like here somewhere. But even then, I don't think it's gonna be very. I don't think I can really join it here. Like it's gonna, it's just gonna add more nonsense, basically. I believe. The intersection of doom. Yeah, it's looking that way, isn't it? Like, I could do this and have this sort of, like, basically join on over here. But obviously, the wrong way around. But I don't know how much this is actually going to speed things up. I'll make it look better in a bit. Because all this is going to end up doing is adding a larger... See, look, these people are just coming off here to go this way. We don't want that. I could force people to go this way, like a no left turn kind of kind of situation. How do we do junction restrictions? I don't know what these are. There are people crossing here. Actually, screw it, William Mon. Um, yeah, I do not want people going this way. I only want them going either down here or that way. There's a no left turn situation right here. <laughs> As it goes past, said the llama. Oh, that seems to be helping, I guess. That is just completely diverting people from from that from that route. All right, can we make this look any better then? Get in a little bit. Jesus Christ, look at the angle is here. God damn! They're like, Jesus, the fuck's going on here? Oh no, that's horrible. Um. <laughs> Alright. Shit. Okay, hang on a minute. It's working fine, but I want to tie it up a little bit. It looks a little bit crazy. I kind of want it to hug a little bit more towards the, uh, What's this? Right, so that seems to have seems to have helped. Like I said, people wanting to leave were mostly fine. It was just this little bit here that was causing a a bit of a kerfuffle. Now people seem happy as Larry to go wherever they want. Okay, that seems to have helped. Well done, me. The ramp of peril and the ramp of peril was real. Yeah, yeah. Much peril involved with the ramps. Right, I think that's helped. Right, so down here. So eventually, what I want to do is we want to have something else that leads up here. So we're going to have a, a, like a, I can't do it yet, but we're going to set up. Basically, where we want a future, like a like a transport hub, this area to be. This is going to be one big ass road that goes all the way around here, and then joins onto the wider city in this kind of method. Does this join on up here? It doesn't yet, does it? That's still going to be funneling everyone. So what I think I need to do as well is try and get a bit, try and get something over here. How are you doing, Iru? I have no idea what Guild of Dungeons is, but nice. We basically want 
an alternative method of getting down here. Problem is, there's a rather large rock in the way. I'd better go round it. Uh. Yeah, there's, a, there's a quite a large rock here. So I'd rather not... Oh, it's not the city limits anyway. Alright, never mind. Been a bit, dude. And then eventually we're going to want a bunch of different things over here. What have we even got? Can I do trains yet? Oh, I can do trains. We've got a train station. Which we're going to obviously want. Because we want to be able to funnel people down from, like, over here somewhere... But also in, you know? Because we've got a train line here. And then we also have a train line down here, which I'm going to have to buy this section so I can actually edit it properly. But we definitely want some sort of a passenger train coming in. I'd really like to be able to see where I'm trying to build. There we go. Alright, so we've got a passenger train. So people are going to come out of the passenger train. Oh, it's a shame it doesn't have like a built-on like underground system, you know? What's this? Elevated metro station. Because we're going to need a metro here. Yeah, the Spaghetti Junction in the UK, it's, it goes around Birmingham. It's, me it's mental. It just looks like a complete just nonsense from above. So we could have it on the other side, but then people will have to cross. And there really isn't a crossing point here. Without me physically adding one, and I can't remember how you add them. Uh, I feel like I can add them, but I think it's a I think it's a separate mod. Oh wait, what was that? Oh shit! Did I just clear the traffic? No, I didn't. Did I? No. Yeah, I think I. So realistically, we definitely want it to be on the side instead. So what we'll do is this side here we'll have. An underground. And then this bit here, we may have like a taxi rank or something like that. We have this here. Can we put a taxi stand here? Just take a taxi stand on that side as well. And then we'll also have bus, we'll have bus routes here too and, and whatever. The bus has come down here yet? You know, I don't even think I have a bus route down here yet. Actually, don't. That's hilarious. But then, yeah, the underground would basically go. We'll join onto probably from around here, then. I don't really know where. I guess it's gonna have to. We're gonna have to run it from. Oh, it's gonna have to join it up here, isn't it? And then this one's gonna have to kind of come. Probably down all the way down there, you know. Well, that's not how I was wanting to build that one. So that will circle all the way around. And it will just jump onto these. Whatever line is on the way. Wait, I'm on the front page of Twitch? <laughs> you s Wait, what? No, I'm not. I ain't got enough viewers for that. You sure that's just not because I'm on your your little you're following me? <laughs> just it for you partners. Oh, okay. Well, that's weird considering you're following me. I was going to say, if I'm on freaking front page, god damn, I'll have much more viewers than 46. Not that there's anything wrong with that, but you know. But yeah, so where's that train line? That train line is here. So, that line's going to want to go... Where is the train line? In suggested, that's cool. <laughs> That's cool. I'll take it. I'm a bit rubbish when it comes to train lines. Um, they always just get clogged up. For me. 
I don't think I don't think it's like legit front page. It must just like you say it's on there as for suggestive partners, which to me is bizarre considering you already follow me. So why I'm a suggestive partner to you, I don't know. To me, that doesn't make any sense. But um, awesome. Thank you, Twitch, for suggesting me to my own followers! Right, we've got to buy this one, haven't we? For now. Then we can use the train line that's coming all the way along here. You know, it's great and all, but yeah, that is that does sound completely useless. <laughs> okay, train line is connected to the outside world. Which goes all the way over there. Now, what we're going to need to do... Is we basically need a separate train line. But probably over here somewhere. That leads all the way to... Well, that bit there, basically. So if we have the line that sort of runs along, or even under... Oh, under would be pretty cool, actually, wouldn't it? All the way under this thing. The epic. And it sort of dips out over here somewhere. So running underneath the uh, the main the main line there, we basically have to have these go across essentially. Uh, as far as I'm aware, we need one that goes that way and then one that joins on over here somewhere. As far as I'm aware, see, I don't know if that works though. That doesn't look like it works, so it probably doesn't. Trying to think how I can properly join this. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that bit there definitely does now. Oh, I can't wait. I'm really excited for Sons of Forest. I really hope it does well for the channel. I really do. Considering of how, like, not necessarily well known, but how much we did in the other ones. That doesn't join there. What's going on here? I'm always really confused about how these, how the train lines work. There we go. Go that way, and then these guys can join on. That comes down there. All I want is this just a, just a, just a way, getting to and from. Basically, I don't even mind if it just starts and ends over here. Oh, which way are people going at the moment? I guess this side we want it the. Just something similar. We'll just have a little, um, a little area where the train line is. Oh, is it? Well, there you go, look. Another train station there. So basically, we'll have the line... Then she just kind of come along here. I mean, I guess I can bring it in and it can sort of swoop around this. Then it'll have a good excuse to kind of pull in here and just kind of go back on itself. Or we could do a circle. I don't, I don't know yet, but... We'll have it running along the side of this. And then it will basically... Kind of go along here. We want it to... Nice, easy curve there. Right, so that then connects. Then this guy over here is going to just want to go... Like that. Accurate noise and everything. Pick him out. No idea what's happening here. There. Bring it sort of like in line. Why on earth did that little bit at the end there? I don't know. Alright. Because then basically this is going to go from here to here and back again. <laughs> that is it. You could have a spur of a smoke. Wood. Yeah, I probably will do. Once we've got this, once we've actually got the train line running where we know it's actually working. Like it is right now. How do you on here? 8%? Wait. Oh, wait. There's no one on it yet. Ba -ba -da. Uh, line details. Oh, we can change the model. Or not. Line color. Blue. Train line one. And this is called... Line 69. There you go. V. 
Vehicle count modifier. Over 200%. 201%, sure. Car's gonna go all the way under here. Under the road, all lovely, all good and proper. Down here, and onto that. And then basically, yeah, this will this will pretty much be the route which it takes. Now we definitely want buses outside here too. And we'll do a bus stop. Ah, right. People are gonna have to cross. See, that's an issue. But I can't select what side it's going from. What if I flip it around the other way? It'll change it. What if we go to here? Do it that way instead. Will the line now be on this side? Yes! Lovely! Alright, so then you can go around a little bit around District 69 here. So this one will just be going around District 69, but then we'll have another one a new line that basically goes from there to over here. No, we'll go from there. It'll go from there into the city. We'll go over to here, over to here. It'll go. What is going on here? Why can't I? Is that a one way road or something? Frick is happening here. Hello? What is this? What has happened here? These aren't actually joined. That's a problem. No idea why. There we go. Bloody idiot! I know they are here either. What the hell? Vass is going on. Oh, that explains a lot. All right. Okay, so then this guy can now go along here without being an idiot. And then this one is going to be like a main line that goes around basically the entire freaking place. Although, no, it has to kind of go... It has to go here, then here, there, and then back again. All right, there we go. We've got a couple of lines up there, so hopefully people start kind of filing in. We can even add a little bit more in the way of, you know, stuff here. Um, little gap there. I don't know if I want the gap or not. Do I want the gap in the middle? Yay or nay? Not really. But there's a taxi rank in the way at the moment, so I'm going to have to go over there. We get a little bit of going across. Even if it's just there. That way we can maximize the area here with a little bit more of District 69. Hello! Hey, 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 oh, 69. And then... In the bit above it, that we aren't really going to mark with much. Probably not going to be a department district yet. But we'll have this bit as... Just generic kind of shopping-y bit. This weird shape and weird size buildings. District 420. <laughs> 12 whole passages. This should hopefully speed things up a little bit. I d it may end up causing more problems with the trains. I don't know. Oh, there's no power there. What the hell? Well, shit. Uh, all right. Do a district of that. And then I guess housing up to this point here. Hopefully people build in that. He has no power. Look at all these people flooding over here. Look at it. Freaking stamp. What the hell is this? Why are there loads of people in pink? Who are you? Spectacular bowling. Oh, hell yeah. Someone's going bowling. Nice. An army of pretty, I don't know. Like an old biddy convention. Look at them all. Jesus. Right, we're gonna need a bus line out here, aren't we? Where are the bus lines? Alright, we'll drag. 
that to there, and then might as well chuck one there. There we go. We've added a bus line now. I mean, to be fair, this line actually only really... This is only really... Oh, God. This, yeah, this, this is not really covering much at all now, is it? We just want lines that kind of run around everything, even if it's not really that beneficial to anybody. Well, it is, but it isn't, you know. Uh, but eventually we'll want ones that kind of cross over into other, other bits. So, for example, we have... Uh, I guess a line that goes here that essentially needs to stop somewhere along the way that already exists. We can stop there. Stop over here at Poshwood. And then it can come down uh, on the way it can hit up that one. Go here and then go along the bottom here. And then up to this one. And that basically merges those two districts. Not very well, but it merges the two districts in some way. Cheshire? No, Ch so so in, in the UK, obviously, a shire, or like Leicestershire, as you, as, or as you guys would pronounce it. Leicestershire, Northamptonshire, yada, yada, yada. Are counties. So we arguably, this is a county. The county of Cheshire. Cheshire, even. Cheshire. What a pillock. Oh my god! How many people are wanting to get on this bus? How many people going in here? Why is no one go- Oh, hang on. It's because there's no freaking lines there. That's why. I didn't actually add the lines. Like a moron. I forgot to add lines! Alright. Go there. You can go... There. You can stop here. No. But you won't take... That turn there, interestingly enough. Alright. Uh... I mean, that's kind of understandable, I suppose. It's a little bit crazy. Will you now? No, why won't you go up that route? Is it because it's on the wrong side? No, that shouldn't matter. It's a freaking train. Hmm. Well, I never. Um... about now? Why are you refusing to use this line? Maybe I should make you go the other direction. If I go this way instead. Oh, we we'll go this way instead. That seems to work. There we go. Lovely. Alright, people might start piling on here instead now. Uh, probably just the absolute shit ton of people that are by here. They did indeed, Moon, yeah. Correct, Mage, yes. Worcestershire is the county to which Worcester is located. Yes, it's like Leicestershire uh, houses Leicester. Nottinghamshire has Nottingham. So on and so forth. Warwickshire has Warwick. Bunch of people piling on here now. 222, that's good. Yeah, I'm currently going through the uh, extended versions of Lord of the Rings. I got, um... Uh, yeah, the extended... Blu-ray for Christmas. Alright. So it seems like we definitely fixed the traffic problem that's going on down here with this kind of weird solution. This, however, I mean, it's not... It's not great. But it's also not terrible. It could be a lot worse. Um... I mean, these seem to move around pretty quickly. I don't know why people are on this side of the road. Where are they coming from? 
pouring down here. I don't know where they're going. What the hell? I guess they're trying to get over there. Maybe I should be nice and give them an actual like pedestrian bit to go over. I really wish, yeah, I, I need to find a mod to turn off zebra crossings. Kind of annoying. How's going on here? Why is this being weird? Right, I need you to come from like from there. Go up there. Go across there. What's going on there. Hopefully. Will people use that? I don't even know if people will use it or not. To be honest, they probably won't, because I imagine going across here is still quicker. It's just not ideal. I know, some people are using it. Especially on the way back. That's good. No, go. Alright, we've done a lot of management so far today. Hey, at least we've got a fair few people using the trains now. I will probably add a cargo one on here at some point that will join on somewhere down. Somewhere probably, oh, I'll probably just come up there, you know. Cargo can just come straight up here. Oh, that's the wrong one, that's why. Cargo can just come over here. They're doing da. And I guess it will just sort of sit somewhere over here. But then we also need it to be able to go back on itself. At some point. Otherwise it's going to leave. I mean it doesn't have to. It will just leave out of here I guess. But I mean ideally we want it to sort of loop back around in some manner. And train cargo, cargo train terminal. Hopefully, will be useful. I just don't want it to clog up the. Oh, everyone like that. I don't want it to clog up the area too much. Wow, that was a major upgrade, actually. A lot of people like this. That's the sound. It's an accurate version of the sound that was being made there. I thought it did quite a good job as well, frankly. Have a little bit more, why not? How do we do for power, actually? Yeah. Getting a bit of pants. Um, so yeah, I don't know how well this will actually be used, but this should be able to just join on. We may need to arc it around here as well, so we can people go up that way, but... I don't know, we'll figure it out. See if there's a need. We basically don't want there to be too much of a... Too much train lines that cause more problems than they solve. I don't know which side they travel on, to be honest with you. I'm actually not sure. Does that make a difference? Where are they? Give me a train. What side's he going on? So he's going that way. I know they can cut over and whatever. So they go on the right. They come in, I think. I'm not sure. Until we get one, we don't really know. So they go on the right to come in, and then go on the left to leave. Uh, yeah, it's not really ideal. But hey ho. Like, we just don't really want them crossing, that's the problem. Um, but I guess we can do like something alongside it. Comes along offside. And then we'll have it turn here. I'm not going to join on immediately because we want to give it some space before it joins on. It can go on there. Right, hopefully. That'll enable them to go back round and down. Anyone that wants to. 
But obviously, we don't know until people start using it. Currently, I don't think anyone's using it right now. Oh, there we go. Our first truck. GG's truck. And we should have a train... Coming in eventually. I just need to pick out where Gopher's Crevice is going to go. Um, which is going to be... Ah. Oh, it's an old train line. Which is going to be basically where all the sewage is. So we've managed to add trains in the last hour that connect our District 69. I mean, we're actually getting a good amount of people being uh, using it. What about this one? Only 16 people. People really like buses instead. I suppose they're getting on the bus because it loops them around here instead. Do we not have a... Yeah, see, whereas we don't really have... Yeah, see, that's the issue, look. This has to go all the way around that way before it gets to here, which is probably where most people are going to get off. Whereas the bus goes all the way around here. Obviously, we could add its own its own line here. For lazy people. Even though it's completely pointless. Uh, but we could add its own line. But we just wanted to make sure it... Come up there. But then we also wanted to kind of join... Like that. So ultimately we want it going from... Going around here. Why wouldn't you go... What is with its... Why won't they go across? It's because oh, it's, it's cutting across. Alright, what if we go backwards then? We go this way. Why wouldn't you go down there? It's on the same freaking line, you idiots. Oh my god, they're so annoying. I don't care about how it looks at the moment. I'm trying to get some freaking work. Oh my god, I just deleted the whole feckin' line. Shh. This just does not join into anything. This doesn't work on any line, apparently. Oh, right, you go this way first, then. No idea if that's even a working line. Apparently these don't work. And I'm not entirely sure why. What if I... Delete that. It, so it can't even get from here... To here. Which is weird. to there though but it just won't go back the other way it is refusing to go that way for some reason I'm assuming it's something to do with this not being very friendly or something I don't, I, I don't know but yeah it just will not it will not go down this line I don't know what have I just deleted now Oh god, I've no idea what this what's going on here now. Don't know what that was, but alright. Yeah, not really sure what's going on there. Maybe that isn't the greatest place, maybe I should have it here instead. Uh maybe even there. I kind of wanted it in the middle. Where it is, is a good location. It's completely pointless, because it's literally taking you like... Four feet, but...
There we go. Alrighty. No idea what you are, though. Oh, for feck's sake. Let's delete another one. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Right, that's done. I hate these lines. I really don't like them. Alright, so now we have a little loop that kind of goes around in internally here as well. I don't think many more people are going to use it, but there's a lot of people crowding for this bus. We should probably figure out... What line is this? Bus line... This needs to be bus line 69 as well. But this guy... This can be... It needs to be a different colour. Bus line 69 is going to be red. But there needs to be more vehicles in it. Bus line 69. Right, so bus line 69 is red. Who are you then? Bus line 9. Is that like the same thing? Or is bus line 69 the one that goes all the way out? I think it might be. Is that what it said? Car trip saved 69%. Is that literally what it just said? Where did you see that? Oh my god, no way! <laughs> That's amazing. Car trip saved 69%. Well, it's done exactly what it needed to do then, eh? They have succeeded. They have, they have succeeded. G freaking G's. That, that deserves a giggity. Giggity giggity. Giggity goo. Alright. Lovely. What's going on here then? Oh my god. Why is there another line issue? What line is that? I don't even know what line that is. That's something that really annoys me about these. This like, oh we got a line problem. I ain't gonna tell you what freaking line problem it is though. And then you're deleting your whole freaking line. Like, there must be a way. Metro line 5. Where the feck are you going? I'm assuming you're the one that went down here. No one's bloody using it. I'll delete it. I don't know where Metro Line 5 was going. Not a clue where that line was actually going. I think it was the one that went around here. How are you doing, RJ? I think it was the one that looped around that bit, but I don't know where it actually went. Can I change the colour of the lines? Oh, I can. Alright. Alright, so that light blue one. What I might do is, I might make light blue ones a small circle. Oh, bloody hell. We've got light blue that goes there. What's this line here, then? That is like... What is that? That's the shoe line. Metro line 2... Is the shoe line. Because that looks like a shoe. Uh, this one here is just... That is the bean line. Like a bean. <laughs> That's the bean line. And we've got shoe line. And what's this one here? That is the large... That is the... Like, that's a, like... I don't know what that is. It's like a giant foot. But it's like... I don't, that's the pheasant line, because it looks a little bit like a pheasant. You see, like, its head here, and then it's got, like, a tail. It needs little feet, and it'll be the pheasant line. Pheasant. Pheasant or pheasant? No, pheasant. How do you maul? I love this game. One of my favourite games. What's this one here? Completely useless, that's what that one is. What the hell is that one? 
That is the one I think I just broke. Also, no idea what's going on with that line. What is that line? Oh, that one goes... Hang on a minute. Right, this line can go. I don't know what that line actually does. Oh, where's the other broken line? Right, hang on. So, bean line is there that can be in blue. Pheasant line can be like an orange colour. A pheasant. The bean line can be brown. Oh, wait, that's already blue anyway. Oh, that's fine. We'll leave that as blue. Shoe line can be brown. That's too similar. We need that to be like something completely different, don't we? That can be green. A llama line. Yeah, definitely. Mona Lisa line. <laughs> so, line 69. We'll obviously have a line 69 up here. Is... That one. Metro Line 7 is Line 69. What? That can be red. M matching the other one. Alright, and then we've also got... So that line there... Doesn't... It's got a lot of passages, but it doesn't really work. How do I edit this line? Yeah, we might have just need to delete that line and rebuild it, because that's that's just kind of stupid. Where's it going though? Hang on a minute. So it's going from This line is going from there to here. Which way is it going though? It's going from there. So I think this is the one that maybe it went round. Let me delete you for a second. And then we'll do create a new line. Go there. Go there, go there, go there, and then end there. All right, cool. And that was Metro Line 9. That one that's flashing currently. I don't know what that is. It's a little bit like a shotgun at the moment, isn't it? So that line is just the larger... That is just a larger line. That's just that just. I, don't know, I guess that's the circle line. And then Metro Line Nine is I don't know what that is. It looks like a shotgun, doesn't it? Like a freaking blunderbuss. Um. I guess that's like office, office and that's like office and residential. So that's the roughest line. Or the refis. There you go. Residential office. Refis line. There you go. Makes no sense, but we'll, it'll work. Oh, there we go. That's a bit better. I'm going to be bloody knackered, yeah. I already am. So we do something similar with this, where we have this higher bit that goes along here as well. We'll definitely be doing something similar there. So we want to try and get the, the height map, which I guess is... Honestly, I've got no idea what the height over here is. I suppose we should just like that. It's going to have to go over here. Wow. There we go. So just for the time being, we're just going to flatten this bit just so we know what the height is. A higher. It's really high, isn't it? Got that one instead. Oh, there we go. That's better. And bring you round a bit. Oh, hey up. That ain't good. I have to smoothen this one out. Oh, no! Okay. That'll end up coming over here and going around. 
<laughs> the Chaley Wood sign. <laughs> oh, yeah. We got an issue with. No, but I imagine having problems getting people down here. I should probably have a larger dedicated recycling center down here alone, but. Because it's going to take a while for. Actually, it shouldn't really. They're not that far from here. Just straight on here. Sorry, people that were working there. You are not allowed. Right, so District 69 has grown. Um, we're going to put some more housing there. <sighs> but yeah, so we need to figure out what's going on over here. Can I build here now? That's oh, sweet. But we're going to also need probably a, a main road that joins onto 69 here somewhere. Probably going to come out of here, if I'm honest with you. I feel like it's going to have to. That means... Oh, we can't even... Oh, the shit. That's in the way, though. Oh, bollocks. I can't upgrade this because that motherfucker's in the way. And moving it is going to cause a right pain in the ass. Shit. Uh, Alright, then. I guess I ain't coming up there. Sorry guys, you can move again again. I guess I'm gonna go this way instead. This way we've got freedom to build that through there. Oh well never mind. Uh and we're probably got to go round this rock. Nice big bit of road that goes round a large rock. Why the frick not? I'm going down the more in the day when I can actually see what I'm doing. Rock of Doom circle. Like that oh yeah, we can call it the Rock of Doom! It is the Rock of Doom right here. Kent Square. It's not a square. Rock of Doom Circle. Policies. <laughs> Recreational use. Uh, harsher prison sentences if you do anything in the, in the Rock of Doom. Free Wi-Fi in the Rock of Doom. Um, smoking ban. There's no smoking in the Rock of Doom. Dangerous. You might die. Taxation. I don't know yet. Sea planning. Uh, encourage biking around the Rock of Doom. Lightning rods in the Rock of Doom. There's a VIP area if you happen to live here. You have to drive an electric car if you happen to live there. I don't know if you're going to live here. Maybe we put like a circle of like houses that go around it. This is going to be like the highest. This is going to be the smallest but like the highest value area going. <laughs> High tech housing. Alright, so we're going to have to build around this thing. We're going to have to probably redo a little bit of it. Because I want to get this road as close as humanly possible to this, whatever this rock is. And maybe even just go all the way around it as well. Physically as close as it can humanly get. Unfortunately, oh yeah. It's quite a large rock that's being deleted there. We can't have that. Oh my word! What's happening here? Alright. Scoot me in close, please, game. Wait, is Anarchy on? Anarchy is on. Will it delete that if I put... Oh, I don't, I don't want to risk it. How large can you scale around about? I'm as big as I want it to, really. But it, doing it around this is just not going to be really... It's not going to work. But I probably will make it one way. Sure. Okay, so we can't come out here now. Sort of. I just can't really turn. Go like there. Right. That's gone around the rock. We want to bring it in nice and close. Here. Here. Uh, are we going to try it? We probably can't join it there. We could probably join it, like, here. Annihilate these people's houses here. This is a horrible little way around. But, that doesn't matter. I'm going to go in this way. Okay, 
and then we've got to have this bit join on, right? Yeah. Okay, so we now have to enclose the Rock of Doom. We have to enclose the Rock of Doom. These people are already living here, so lucky them. So we're going to have building there. These guys can live there. Hey, what's going on here? Where are we going again? This way, aren't we? Alright, cool. Alright, so the Rock of Doom is going to go along here. Along here. And we're basically going to flesh out whoops, the outer bits here. You know what? You can live in the Rock of Doom, sir, because you are quite close. Alright. All of these are going to be the lucky people that get to live around the Rock of Doom. There's not really much I can do to increase the value of the area here. I feel like I should add more rocks, though. <laughs> In these spaces. That's better. Alright, can we get rid of all this? Really? Oh no, did I have... Oh, what the hell? How long has that been on for? Oh, crap. I didn't realise this was on. Right, I can do this on move it, right? I can just select... freaking trees. Oh, screw it. I'm just I didn't turn it on. I must have been on automatically when I first opened it then. I do a metal monster. How long has that been on and causing problems? It must have just been turned on. Maybe I pressed something and turned it on by accident. I'm going to get rid of those two, unfortunately. I don't seem to select them. Yeah, that doesn't seem to exist for me to select. Oh, that's better. Okay. Oh, I hope that's not cause like... Problems on, like, the train lines and stuff. I don't think it has. Alright. Anything else we can do here to make it even better? I guess we should probably not... Should we have recreational use? No, let's not have recreational use on, actually. But that's going to, like, lower the value of the area. This area needs to have high values. Alright, let's add some stuff. Let's add a little thingy here. Add one of them here. I actually can't... Oh, there's someone's building there. I mean, that doesn't actually really make any sense. It's sort of on, like, a cliff thing, but... Oh, yeah. I hope we had some uh, water going around the Rock of Doom. This is going to be a high, a high value area, basically. Scarlet Boulevard. This should be called Boulder Boulevard. Nice, but bold, 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 bolder, bold, bolder. I think I've ever used freaking boulder in my life. Yeah, that's right. We don't really talk about boulders in the UK. Alright, there we go. So the Rock of Doom has its bit. Some of the highest value living down here is around the Rock of Doom. What other policies can we turn on here? It's got harsh prison sentences. <laughs> if people commit crimes here. <laughs> um...
I'll do for now. I mean, we could probably have a little road that comes off here at some point. Or like a walkway, I don't know. But not bad. Dolphins say fishing in this area, yeah. How popular are these now? Why is that only servicing one passenger? I think everyone's obsessed with the bus line, if I'm honest with you. Which is weird. I guess the stops are better. That's 65. Yeah, it seems like everyone that comes... Oh, there we go, 36. It kind of varies. 300 odd people there. Alright. How we doing? Oh yeah. Posh ass park. How you doing down here? Entertainment till next level. Need to get four more entertainment value in here. Can I add anything? I don't even know. And what adds entertainment value? What the hell adds entertainment value to these things? Entertainment plus 50. Here we go. I'll add a, I'll add a shitter over here, look. Yeah! Here we go. 425. Beautiful. I'm not really sure if many people actually visit this thing. <laughs> no, but I, I, don't, I don't know. Can we see? We just had 1,700 visitors, that's it. Oh, 14. There we go. That's not the main park. Fireworks in the show every night. Cycle garbage. Okay. Yeah, Posh House Park, yeah. <laughs> so, we've got Posh House Park. We've got... There's another park somewhere. Crapwood Park. Next to Crappington. Which is next to the Walnut District, near Wood District. We've got Poshwood, and then we've got Bull Acre. Now, Bull Acre's quite big. Bull Acre is quite a large. It's our largest district, actually, I think. Yeah, the district of Bull Acre is actually the biggest one. Oh, hello, what's going on here? It's actually the biggest one. Oh, that was fine. We had that on purpose, right? Uh, Rosewood is good. We might as well bring this up. Oh, hang on. Yeah, that's fine. I'll bring this up here. Wait a minute. These people here. There we go. They have a, a bit of a lap over there. They'd have been the only people living in District 69. Alright, cool. I guess we can increase this out to here. I don't know how many of people are actually using this. Cool. Then Gopher's, Gopher's Crevice is going to become the area where, like, all of the, the sewage and the garbage goes. And, like, where all the water and stuff is. Or at least the sewage treatment areas. It's going to be Gopher's Crevice. Um, but, yeah. What's this? What is this? Oh, it's the park maintenance building. Ooh. So yeah, so Bull Acre can't really go on for much longer. How are we doing for traffic? Traffic is a lot better than what it was. We have solved the traffic, except for this. We've solved the traffic issues. It was a lot worse in here earlier. There was tailbacks, but there's no longer a tailback. Which is good. I mean, no one really uses this route. Frankly, it's hilarious, but there's not really a lot down here at the moment, so that's obviously why. And the trains seem to be being used quite a lot, which is also good. I mean, Crapwood can't really get any bigger, but Crapwood Park... Well, Crapwood Park should obviously be full of, like, fireworks. Fireworks show the bug every night. Actually, no, we won't do that. We're going to have a big park somewhere. I don't know where. Probably over here. 
And that is over there. This is bit over here is going to be Lake Flaccid. Which is going to mainly be like a nature reserve. Because we can do nature reserves, I think. We're a nature reserve. Yeah, we can do a nature reserve. And I'm pretty sure we can have like... Yeah, like viewing decks and all kinds of shit. Uh, I think there might even be jetties in there. Fishing cabins. Yeah, that's going to be all in that. <sighs> yeah, that's Lake Flaccid. Uh, which we will eventually get over to do. And then we'll probably have like a... Nature Reserve slash Main Park. Maybe a bit of both. Maybe, the, maybe that is in. I don't know if we can do both. I'm not sure. But it might be the main it might be the main one. Then we'll have another main city that's kind of like either looks over it, kind of around it, or looks over it. I'm not really sure. Um because there's a lot of mountain range otherwise. Oh, what is that? It's like a little maze over there. But currently we're building our main our main town around this bit here. Currently. Yes, yeah, so you can see a giant sewage plume going downstream. Yep. <laughs> that will eventually come from Gopher's Crevice. Can't effing see. So we have to get rid of that little bit there. And it'd be nice to have something on here. Follow like the way in which the water zooms around it, but um we'll get rid of it for now. Oops, oh, steady on there, sir. Steady on there. Get back in there. Thank you. We will have to pick an area. Is there like a shipping lane area here? Can I see the shipping lanes? I don't know. I can add my own ships here, but I don't know if there's like an actual lane where we can do an outside shipping route. I can't seem to see one. There may not be one. That's fine. I don't think we'll know until we can get, like, the harbour and whatnot. Ugh. We need a carnival ground. Yeah, we're going to have a carnival ground eventually. There's a lot still to do. We were still very, very early days. Yeah, I need to figure out where I'm going to put Gopher's Crevice. Um, I guess maybe over here. Maybe in this sort of section up here, this sort of just square, we can have a lot of, like, water treatment and whatever going on. I will have to then redo this whole bit here and have a main little area that comes in. But we could easily do that up there. I can probably buy that now as we go. Yeah, I can. So we can do things like, you know, we can have, like, proper water treatment plants. We can inland water treatment. We can go for the large advanced inland water treatment plant. Uh, or even, you know, tank reservoirs. We could do loads of shit down there. Eco inland one. Bump in service. We had a bunch up there. We'll probably like square it off a little bit. Or maybe even make a little inland, like an inlet bit. Uh, where it all can kind of like funnel around and whatnot. Chauffeur Plaza. <laughs> No, it'd be called um, Gopher's Crevice up there. It's where all the sewage leaves, basically. Yeah, Gopher's Crevice will basically be up here somewhere. But yeah, like I said, what we'll end up doing is we'll probably... What kind of height are we working with up here? It's quite big, actually. It's quite high up. It's all more or less the same height here, so we get rid of you. they probably flatten a lot of the land here, but we kind of want a little bit that comes in, actually. Maybe we should lower the land, if anything. We've got the train line that runs along here, so we'll have a, a key that goes across. Um, but I kind of want a little inlet here. Maybe even, like, this bit here. 
will probably form some kind of an inlet. Where we'll basically have a lot of the pumps and whatever. Or at least the sewage outgoings, you know, I don't know. Maybe we'll have the pumps there and then we can have the sewage outgoings in a different one. Like in there or whatever. Um, and we'll basically key it off. But I need to lower it to a, a height which is a bit more... A bit more reason. Because that's, that's kind of high. Probably more like this height. But I don't really know how well the water's going to flow into it. If it's just going to keep... I don't know the height that... It, I mean, that's already like flowing straight back out again. It's kind of a bit weird, but... I kind of want it to be... this height up here. We can have it looking universal, you know. Uh, yeah, and we basically then... Is he alive yet? Where is the Church of Chai for religious districts? We can actually get... Um, I don't think we've unlocked it yet, but there's, well, there's like the cathedrals anyway, but there is a really big ass church somewhere. I don't know where it falls under. I think it's that. Yeah, the cathedral, the cathedral of plentitude. That will be the church of Chofa because it's it's just nonsense high. Why is all this still here? There's of trees in here. Okay. Got to move it. What a what a mod. Uh, anyway, so yeah, we'll probably do... Why is it always night? I know that's high enough. It might be too high, but we can edit that afterwards if it is. <laughs> Proceeded spy! Thank you very much for the tier one, sir. Welcome. Sorry, sorry. The, the freaking 48 years? That the four years. Thank you very much, Proceeded Spy. For the four years of being subscribed, thank you very much, sir. Welcome back. Welcome back, indeed. Thank you very much. What a legend. Right, this is not going to allow me to be very square, is it? That's not even the right one. That's why. Okay, it will be. I just have to kind of force it to be square. Where? I don't even know. Mental is what it is. But because it's fecking night time, I can't see shit up here. I think that did it. I have no idea. I think I, you know, I understand the reason people play in. Oh, lovely. Gazebos. I understand the reason people play in, like, permanent day mode. So you can actually see what they're building. God damn. Okay, so we'll have one like that. And I guess this will sort of line up in another way. But we need to make sure that this whole area is raised. It's a little bit weird here. I don't think there's a way that I can force it to be the height that I want it to be. Even with movie, I don't think it will. Whoops. Why am I in this mode? There we go. Okay, I actually can. All right. It's still not that. I mean, that is not the same height, but okay. That's better. Okay, and then we we're going to do... That's going to probably come across here. We're probably going to curve around to there, actually. So let's probably do this bit here first. You can come out into there. What's going on here? Not sure what's going on here. Oh, that's better. All right. Then this guy will go out from here. Around like that. Lovely. 
And then that's going to have to kind of come out. Go around there. This guy is going to have to sort of come out and go around there-ish. All right. This is going to be our water treatment sort of thing. Bit. Area. Type deal. <laughs> Ellie! <laughs> with the tier goddamn two? Thank you very, very... I know it says months. We're just doing years. Thank you very, very much. Look at that beautiful badge. On Proceeded Spies 48 months. But thank you, Ellie, for the tier two. Welcome back. Thank you very, very much indeed. Very much appreciated. These are all weird heights. Like, this height does not make any sense. I mean, I know that bit needs changing, but easy. The land around it. Don't make any bloody sense, chap. I mean, I have just completely butchered it. Uh, I'll go over to go for a second. Right, yes, yeah, so, okay, so I think it's just the, because I think these. I don't think are the same height as that. Oh no, they were. Wait, what? Apparently they are. But all this in here isn't. That doesn't make any sense. How is... Not again. How is all this, like, the wrong way around? I don't know. Anyway... We will go over to Mr. Gopher. Okay, yeah, I freaking... Honestly, the night time in this game is just ridiculous. I can't see anything. I'll brush, the brush side is too big as well. Some sort of rough. No, it's roughly there. Yeah, this is just making no sense at all up here. This isn't flattening to the same height, even though it's the same height. It doesn't make any sense. Like, this, this up here is not the same height as the rest of it, even though it's actually the same height. I'm not really sure what's going on there. Game just being a bit weird, I think. This bit around here is acceptable, because it is just kind of mental over there. But these bits here... Unacceptable! I can literally see the land is a different height. For whatever reason... It is not flattening properly. How do I deselect all of this? No, oh, just clicking on one of them. Okay. So, like, that node there, I want it to be. Okay, so that's weird. As soon as I have to select the exact node as opposed to. Yeah, that would have been why. It's these small circles. It's that circle I need to click, not the whole thing in general. There we go. That's better. Now it's the same height. These bits aren't, but... I didn't realize I had to select the exact... Like that bit. The exact node. I thought you could just select the whole road and it would also work. Not the whole road. You know what about. That's much better! We'll do the same with this bit and then I'll uh, I'll move over. Like that. I don't know if I can set the ends of the roads, or if I have to do all the little bits. I think I have to do all the little bits. Oh, there we go. The area is the same height now. So we can add, like, roads and, and shit. We can move, like, all of this. So these guys are going to go in here, and they should pump out and go that way. And then in these, so we're going to have to do that pretty soon. We can't move these until all this flows away. Um, and then we'll sort out whatever's going on here, which means I can also bring all of this up here and we can, we can sort that out.
Brother, the bird, 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 br